trade. They actually get the site. So the spike will get planted. Seconds left. But it is with a player disadvantage. And now Doma will even Sassle it up. Out. Yeah, that's a good one from Doma. But oh, a bit of a dud on the blast pack. Doesn't get on top of any boxes. Talking about silence, this retake completely quiet. The exile are on the cusp of moving in here. We got the smoke over towards the top of sewers. Moe's not able to get into the engagement. Mystic's about to get, oh, not even. He dodges the stun. Moe's gonna get chipped away at slightly. Here comes the fall in from the heavens. Fiku with the headshot. Senders on the defuse already. One man left intact. Oh, can he take him off? Absolutely. My goodness. He doesn't, they actually rotate over and it looks like they want to lead in with the drone. Whoa. But there's two players here. Oh, uh-oh. Dud on the first shot. Second connects to the head. Mystic trades. Sees the player on the back of sight. And that's all that Exile have right now. Just that one choked up opening. Oh, good shock dart. Drops the omen onto 11. A peek from Garage that never comes through, though. He comes back. Sender thinking maybe he was going to get pushed. Oh, the shock dart kill from Entril. Boaster's going to take to the corner, tries to find that further duel. Good reposition with the crosshair to splatter both of those players. Packing across the site with Rays. Used to seeing Jet make that much space. Take flight. Showstopper finds nothing. Burnt alt for summon. Only one on the other side that could be from the shadows, but no real need for it. Retake gets going. Three players already out from their spawn, and Summon's keeping this one even. Boaster goes down. Mo, oh, he's been droned. And that's a three-piece from Creon, and Sender's gonna close it. You know what, man? I, I, I really, it really has felt like in these situations through mid, uh, like they own the site, and... And, and still, even with that info, it just becomes like a standard A retake. Yep. But it's ultimately the Killjoy lockdown that comes in as the most important alt of the round. Yeah, forces the flanker to go forward. He wanted to hit before the Killjoy alt goes off. He could have even interrupted it, knowing it was down there in the sewers. But then there was that disjointedness in exile. Yes, one player runs in. The others are waiting for the full-blown retake. And it is in that realm of possibility that summon walk out on top. So five rounds to three. They have lifted the curse that was three rounds in a row for Exile. Now we fall back into that silent default peak from Fiku. Cage triggered. And a second connects into the head of Doma. Mystic will be able to trade, and they predict the peak from above. Dreamus wanting to get that operator in position. Hunter's Fury to deny any kind of a plant, but he's missing the mark, in fact. Yeah, that looked like that second one was going to be good. Ooh, nice TP. Dodge from Mo. The dart will come out. It gets a scan as well, but the paranoia kind of resets the information situation. Mystic, he's going to be playing down into hell. Off of that info, Mo goes for his peak, but it's nice, crisp kills from Exile. Oh, man. They take their fourth, and now we've got a back and forth affair. Yes, and they started out quick 5v4, and then they didn't. They only looked up into the B site. It was a problem in the past, but Dreamus has a very strong angle to try to deal with this. Oh, oh my god. Unless you've got a Sheriff in your face. The spike oh. will not get planted, and everybody dies. Yeah, Creon, good play. Comes in from window side, denies the spike plant. Everybody else was a little preoccupied. Four kills versus just reach to take position on back B site. So, meant to peel numbers off of the C stack, but there are still three players here, including the Showstopper, whipped out and still held on to Doma. He's able to get it from downtown, blasts Dreamus into tomorrow. And Boaster now with the Rolling Thunder just to confirm the backside's clear. But, oh, Creon, he's not gone checked. He gets killed by Doma on the other side. Oh my god. It looked like he was going to have that corner position to run rampant in the mid round play. But a sixth for summon looking oh so likely. Entral 1v4, denied by Tack, and that is their six. They will get through it. Shock Dart. Oh, Shock Dart shouldn't just straight up kill him. Oh, it's gonna Shock hurt. Too. Spike planted. Oh my god, the second one doesn't cat doesn't grab him. Dude, that was down to the wire. He needed to do it preemptively, knowing the amount of time. Yeah. 
I mean, just to be honest, Exile, kind of just lucky that that site wasn't stacked up, that the defenders were instead above. 10 health left for TAC. He's trying to get the kill. Oh, the double nade from Doma. And Mo, he's adding one to the tally. It is summon across the kill feed. They will find that seventh round. Okay, like, Exile looks sick because they were able to... And he's thinking about the possibility of a player inside of Garage, which is an absolute truth. Entril gonna get the better of him. Boaster just stuck out in the open. Now Dreamus is chucking paint shells the other direction. This buy coming in from Exile is working out wonderfully. Oh They've got four players on the opposite side of this mid door. But now that the smoke screens go down, it's the kills coming in for summon. And if they can give cover to the diffuser of the spike, then they could get this over the line. The first player's killed. The nade goes out. Doma's gonna try to stick this, but he just can't. Oh, it's gonna come close. Oh, he doesn't have it. Oh, my. Will Boaster get this kill? Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh God. it hurts. <laughs> okay, guess not. <laughs> Absolutely hard countered. Man, I feel like we've seen more kills from paint shells in this game than all the other series combined. He's, some, he's an artist, man. He's got some really great paint shell kills. Both sides of it, too. Summon. Doma, look, he's priming his. There you go, you want to throw grenades? Get some. Spike planted. Oh, that hurts. Softens him up. But in reality, it is still just the pistols. Bulldog burst shot between the eyes. Goodbye, Mo. Two players left again, just looking for some kind of impact. Crossfire set on the exit. I mean, Exile could literally walk the other way, but they go in instead, and there is the cost. Okay. Doma's gonna put down the bomb, buddy. Are they going? They're still going in. Really? Okay, let's see what more they can add to the tally. Absolutely nothing. That is the ace. Five seconds on the clock. It's just a pragmatic setup from them, right? This was their biggest problem in a force buy situation. They can see the money, they know what might left. come, and what's worked in the past. Showstopper's out. Oh, oh my god, that doesn't kill. It doesn't hit him at all. That's unbelievable. Now the Hunter's Fury comes into the site. He's got them scrambled. He's got them scattered. And Tax stands back to give them the spike plant, perhaps or not, denied by Mystic. The Rolling Thunder and a Showstopper most notably, but it's Rolling Thunders each direction. So just generally everything is slowed. Dreamus, he knows that they're coming in. The Bucky up close, good for the first one. And Creon, well, he shaved a player off thanks to the Sheriff. Oh, what mystic. mystic! Three kills, and now he's gonna get on top of it. Hunter's Fury towards the Diffuser. Mystic has to cower to the corner. He gets killed by Entril, but still Mystic's diffusing all the way. It's Doma with the flop. Oh my god. Got the Sheriff on sender. Oh my god. Bucky in the mix. Ooh, decent damage and teammates to help out. That's an excellent opening, in fact. Oh, but Doma in a precarious position. They're not clearing him, though. Not at all. And because of that, he's going to get a chance. Oh, but Entril's able to save the day. Boaster coming in from heaven. He's got a player beneath him. And the other two members of Summon trying to rotate over. They are so wary of a flank, but there is nothing in position. Good time for the Killjoy ult. Nothing can stop that. That's They're going to have to evacuate. See, now the thing, this is it. We're going to have to see Creon try to get out. He, he's stuck. He is stuck in no man's land, oh so he's just going to have to try and hide. Everybody's going to come back trying to save him. They should clear him from the site. That's easy. And they know that everybody else had to have fallen back. So the turret's going to lend a little bit of a helping hand. Boaster gets a kill to the feed. And now suddenly it's a 3v2. But the peak from Entril, his third kill. Nothing more for anybody else. A 12th. With her showstopper uh, running in here. And we've got a Hunter's Fury for the post plant. Could be a great site to take. Mm -hmm. But it seems like um, oh, again, our defenders seconds. know. Yeah. Look oh. how look how paranoid our defenders are. Here it comes. Showstopper on the hard entry. Oh, trying God. to clear up the corner. Oh my God, doesn't it doesn't land hit. It. Mystic, he's able to get two kills off of Garage. There's the trade back, though. Oh, and Doma stopping it in its 
it's Trax, Entril, one versus four. He's got a player ahead of him with low HP, but he is absolutely oh surrounded. A crucial kill. The turret's left. gonna soften him up. He's being blinded. Six seconds, oh. five seconds. Oh. He compromise. VQ barely alive. Creon, he's gonna get careful. He's gotta get absolutely pushed. Now Mo able to catch one. No, not even. Excuse me, that's Doma with the double. Oh, triple. Wow. Stack him up, Doma. Doma doing him dirty. Entrail will be able to get himself another kill. Mo falls back into the cover of the site. It is a four versus two. So exile in a difficult position, getting softened up continuously by Doma. Two players in the back of this. Oh, on Spike, Minji. Shut down, Entro. Where the kneecaps? Takes him out from underneath, and Zack's gonna get forced into this. His gun goes dry. The defuse in the 2v4. Stick it and take your... Burst is going to happen. Boaster trying to cause a ruckus at mid with the Omen flash, or with the Omen smoke, excuse me. The push is coming through. He might get traded in this spot. I don't know. Raze looks like he wants some business here. Oh. He'll get the kill, so that's something. 5v4 now. Oh. Doma oh. clearing this A site, though. That's the big one. Yeah, that is. It was all on him. However, here comes the show. Oh, my Stopper. God. Yeah, look out for that pillar. Ten Bit seconds of a left. problem. He's had Five. trouble with that. Right into the wall. Who put that there? A little bit awkward. And, well, the retake now all the more difficult. Entro's going to be coming in with this. Just Cage still has the dart on him. Mystic back in the corner behind the column falls. That pushes pressure onto Doma. He sees the weapon swap. Two players back in that very narrow cubby. And yet they're able to disengage. A jumping kill from Sender. But little HP on Cypher means Doma's going to whip out the ult and get the job done. Once again, Doma one up. Hold this off. He is stunned and blocked out by the Omen smoke. So the spike will go down. That's tough. They're a bit uncomfortable now. Breach dead in the site. Retake positions, I mean, they're okay, but they're so low on util, and uh, Dreamass got all of his baited out when that trap wire got exploded inside of the ropes. And if this retake doesn't come in fast enough, you've got Mystic about to take back Heaven for the d attackers, trying to hang on to the spike here. Players over towards B main. Oh, there's the drop off of the Spectre, the defuse beyond the halfway point. He's got to get him off, but he can't. Oh, doesn't find the angle, and I'd be so... And really aggression towards A. Here we go. Alt's in, Blade Storm. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, now we can see what he can do. And he's going to look for the follow-up. Flying downwards. <laughs> We're all a little bit nervous. Yeah. It's definitely a big moment. Yeah, maybe try ulting on the ground, boys. 28 HP left over for Mystic. He's going to get that spike down. It is the 3v3. This is not a comfortable position for Summon at all. He's going to have to travel from the shadows. Chooses to go back at the base of ramp. Now that lets him double up alongside the breach, but the Neuro Step tells them everything they need to know. Dreamus with two kills at the bottom of the ramp means this is a fourth round for Egg. Yeah, okay. I mean, with the spike plant, it's nice. But still, it's the round that gets one that's more important, and Exile just getting stronger and stronger. Looking good. Ray trap wire is broken. Off your feet, flash out! Come, all comes in heaven, thunder. yeah. Sender's gonna get stunned. Now he sends one back the other direction. This is gonna get hectic on the B site. We've got the showstopper whipped out. Entril, he gets the back of Poster. Three kills in a row coming out from Exile. But it's turned back by Tack, who has himself a teammate on four HP. His hands are gonna be busy with the spike. We've got cloud bursts and omen smokes all over. But Mo delivering despite being low. And Creon's gonna push in onto the spike, taps it. He's trying to get the spray out in the 1v1. He walks oh. right in. Oh man, not slowing down at all. But the abilities will force him to hold a moment. And Ooh. Entril with Creon. Last Those are crucial kills. Creon comes in on the push on the A site. And obviously Entril locking down Heaven. He has been impact. Ooh, showstopper beyond the Omen smokes. Left. 
You can see how that forces the Omen to fall out of screens. There's two players back here, and had they rounded those next corners, it could have been a disaster for the defense. Instead, Creon's gonna get one onto the kill feed. They do have players on the site itself, but we've seen them here before, only to then fall to the retake. And so far, so good from Exile. Yes, there will be an answer from Mystic, but how much can he deliver on only six HP? He's gonna sneak through the smoke. He's got Boaster up in the heavens, but Cypher with eyes behind him. Four of the seven rounds for Exile, also by way of defuse. So they've been hanging on with both hands, man. Trying not to get bucked off this wild ride. Shot at the kneecaps. Attack goes down. Sender flashes through the middle column. But that is a good fault line. Creon's going to try to teleport. It works, but he gets right into the eyes of Summon, who has four kills to his name. And in the one versus one, he is gone. Over to the B site. Or A, excuse me. He will fall on the spike. 30 seconds plant comes left. in. He's got 85 health. Dream S. He's going to start dropping abilities left, right, and center. Peaking wide. He has the health advantage. Ace. That's for certain, but an ace to close the half. Fast flank B. Yeah, that's going to allow for the hard rotate into heaven. And, well, oh, he'll get caught. Spike yeah, that's plant. huge, in fact. Creon coming in from the back just to secure his flank. Works out wonderfully. Yeah, this is going fantastically what is for Exile. Oh, it's flawless! No chance! You can already see this raise in the corner being pinged, so Doma's gonna get stunned. Difficult position. I love it. The Sage Wall oh, goes up. Trade Mystic, he gets the second. Oh, the grenade right on the money. Creon's gonna be able to push past. He only has five bullets. He better oh God, land them. Clear that. He goes for the reload. This buys time. Now, Mo off of the side, also denied any success, but Boaster with the Bucky and Tax right behind him. They've got all three players kind of corralled into the corner. Can they really do the damage from this distance? That's the issue. Dream Ass able to drop another. Yes, he will take one, but two members alive as Exile leap. Rolling Thunder comes out. Everybody hanging on for now. Doma's anticipating some kind of a play. Oh, Mystic! Two headshots. Boaster's got himself a double. And as quickly as the last attempt went well, this one is shut down to... Again, there was a cage on him at first. Oh my goodness gracious, he's gonna try to get out of there. Staying high, really smart move. Oh, above the ult, but then still dies. But the player in the back of sight, Tack. Able to get the quick kill onto Entril. There's his second. More players coming in. And he goes I down. Exactly Mystic's wasting no time. But the boom bot distracts him. And now the neural theft gives away his element of surprise. Creon silently coming up from ropes. Cuts down Boaster. And what do you know? Man advantage here for Exile as the spike goes down. Spike planted. Yeah, well, Creon, he looks like he's trying to press out. He'll look for it. Oh my god, the awareness. Mystic, one on one situation. Headshot to lock it up that's the first player to get them to double digits and it's not cross heaven yeah they could be right on the cusp oh but the revive sage with the revive it's a perfect rolling thunder doma peeks right into it these last two players stuck in the corner the grenade forces them in and it's a 4k on for the eight and five and they can't think about flanking because they're scared that someone's pushed a or b the mind games go both ways and so sometimes we see what we're seeing now. It's a freeze. However, Sender drops down into ropes right where Mystic wants him. Yeah. And not ends up getting killed. The Doma oh my just God. got the showstopper, whips it out. He dies, but the rocket's still able to connect. Left. Dreamus is going to go ahead and put down that spike. He's taking damage. Oh, but it's enough of a distraction. Sender comes in off the top shelf. Dreamus can now walk forward, and he's looking for the gun. He's got paws on the Vandal. Fresh reload, but the cloud burn is not enough. It doesn't stop the shots. This would be the thrifty round win to keep them within one, to deny summon that 12th round they already thought they'd secured. Abilities coming out from Breach. The blind connects. Boaster on top of the spike the comes read. off of it. He thinks it's heaven, but Dreamus, he holds back deep. He's waiting and waiting, and it could work out wonderfully. Now he's going to go running in, but he dies out to Boaster. There's no time. A 10th round for Exile, and Bind keeps on giving. It's so damn close. Boaster, he had... 
Multiple bodies. Oh, and he gets Entril. That's an easy first pickup. The Omen Smoke on top, but Tack through the Cypher Cage. There goes the Blade Storm. It's a miss, but he finds himself now behind enemy lines with cover. 19 HP. The dash away from it gives them a chance to breathe. Exile are on the site, and Sender's got that spike down. Here comes the Bucky. Denied in a five versus one. It looks like Summon have done it. Sender trying to hang on, and they will win on 